What is up, Humanoid Nation? So, the WWE is bringing back the brand extension. Raw has their own brand, and SmackDown has their own brand as well. Personally, I never minded the original brand extension. I actually liked it. True, at first, they didn't know what the fuck they were doing, because every week... One of their guys was on SmackDown, one of the other guys was on Raw, back and forth. But when they actually fixed it, and actually knew what they were fucking doing, they had some good-ass shows. And you gotta admit, there was a time there where SmackDown, when it was written by Paul Heyman, that SmackDown was the better show than Raw, because Raw was the Triple H show, with all his bullshit. Remember those dark times? Triple H getting the world title just because the fuck of it. Eric Bischoff just giving him the title. And then going on a burying spree for months. Just burying wrestles like Booker T, Rob Van Dam, Kane, and all that shit. Although I'm just wondering, with the Brad extension, are we having our separate pay-per-views again? Like Raw pay-per-view and SmackDown pay-per-view? Because that'd be pretty cool too. Because like if you have a Raw and SmackDown broken up you gotta bring back the separate pay-per-views at least give the guys a shot on each show although i don't want them to bring back new year's revolution or taboo tuesday oh god no not taboo tuesday the dark times of pay-per-views just leave it be don't put an extra pay-per-view i'm just hoping they don't do that but i kind of wish they do separate pay-per-views for the raw and smackdown as for the titles, they're talking about like having the world title be defended on both shows, which is makes sense because there's one world title defended on both shows. Although they did have two different titles when brand extension, because that's what they did. But seriously, they should keep it with one world title this time, because I like to see the world title be defended on both shows. Same with the tag team titles and the women's title, because that'd be a pretty amazing. Come on, you really like having different guys challenging for the title each time, except, yeah, it'd be kind of cool. And also, along with that, but like I said, I knew some people had problems with the brand extension. That's your opinion. We all have our opinions. But like I said, I never had a problem with it, except for the beginning. And then the dying years is when it started to suck. But during the middle of it, it was pretty good. Especially the SmackDown era, like I said, numerous times. Besides what's going on with the brand extension, SmackDown is being moved from Thursday nights to Tuesday nights to the ones where they actually tape Tuesdays, but they film it on, but it comes out on Thursday. And we all know it's taped on Tuesday, which was the inside joke. But now they're actually putting it live for, for the first time ever. That's pretty cool. Having Raw live and then choosing live SmackDown. That's going to be a lot of bullshit going on there i was just wondering how they're gonna do it like yeah of course they're gonna do it but that's a pretty cool concept of having raw and smackdown live for the hell of it and actually having it filmed tuesday and actually shown tuesday instead of having to wait thursday or before it was on friday when it was on friday night smackdown but did anybody ever watch friday night smackdown i watched it once or twice but i had shit to do on friday that was the worst time to put wrestling on. <laughs> like, between the ropes set it back in the day. Why the fuck would you put it on Friday? People are going out and doing shit. People are busy Friday. The people have no time for wrestling. But yeah, they did it. And that's when I stopped watching Friday Night Smackdown. And yeah, because I had shit to do. Not go out, but sometimes I had to go out. But I had shit to do. Really, it's the worst time to uh, put it on there. <laughs> So yeah, that's what's going on. Oh yeah, Eden Styles left. Boo! I could really care less about Eden Styles. <laughs> She's married to Cody Rhodes, right? Who also left? Or is that somebody else? I don't know. I don't care. But yeah, what do you guys think of what's going on? The brand extension and Tuesday Night Smackdown. And if you want, Eden Styles leaving. Whoa, boo. But anyways, that's it for now. Take it easy, Humanoid Nation. Humanoid freak out. Bye.